This flashy little snail exhibiting some decorative horns is no longer functioning like it used to. It has been taken over by a parasitic flatworm that has been developing inside it for quite some time. But our slow moving friend is just a means to an end. And the worm's final destination is the comfy innards of an unsuspecting bird. The tiny invader called the green banded brood sac begins as an egg and enters the snail's body through the vessel of bird poop a common food source for the snail. Once inside it hatches and begins to go through a sequence of larval stages, multiplying and developing into long tubes aka brood sacs which extend into the snail's eyes. Here is where the magic happens. These brood sacs cause the eye stalks of the snail to swell and pulsate bands of color which mimic the appearance of a caterpillar or grub. Once these highly visible tasty morsels become fixed atop the snail's head, the parasite goes one step further, taking control of the snail's mind and influencing its behavior. In an effort to get noticed, the parasite forces the snail to actually seek out broad open areas in the middle of the daylight, such as high leaf tops. This is counterintuitive to the snail's instinct, usually preferring dark moist areas, abundant in food and safe from predators. And to top it all off, the brood sacs pulse and twitch more and more violently as the intensity of light increases. When this happens, the snail's fate is pretty much sealed, destined to be devoured by a hungry bird where the green banded brood sac will eventually call its new home. And to continue the cycle of life, the bird will shit out some more eggs for another snail to ingest. Once again, thanks for tuning in and giddy up.